guys, it's Wendy here with In Focus Prints, and today I am going to be doing my first event for my December dailies, and um, I'm looking over here at my archival ink, so I was just trying to figure out what color I was going to use to coat, um, to paint my, or stamp my number one. So the kit that I am using is from at, um, Allie Edwards, and um, this is the new book that she has this year, which is a three by eight. And I thought this would be a fitting size for me. It would be easier, and um, <clears throat> I just thought it would fit my needs better. Um, the other thing that I'm doing, I'm not doing a December daily of December 1st, 2nd, 3rd. I am actually doing um, one of the ways that she was saying um, would you could do your December dailies is to plan, um, is to document 31 events that happen during the holiday season. So that is what I thought would be better for me. So I am going to be setting up this first one for my December daily event one um, and this is going to be the Moscow Ballet the Russian Moscow Ballet that presented the Nutcracker and so me and my friend Liz um, went to see them and so I took photos for that and I just took random photos during the show and then I picked out the ones that I thought I liked best um, last year, this couple danced, and it's it's really hard to tell, but these are the feet of the girl, and this is her arm, and then the body of the gentleman, and then that's his arm. So it's two arms, and they do this dance, and it puts them together into a dove, and it is absolutely beautiful. So I had to use that one, and then the other one that I did was the Rat King and these are his little mice and these are kids from the neighborhood ballet um, that came and auditioned to dance with the Nutcracker and so I thought this was so appropriate because everybody you know thinks of the Rat King in um, the Nutcracker so those are the two photos that I'm going to be using I already to speed things up I have already written um, about the night just a little snippet so that I can remember it I also have the um, program from it that I'm going to enclose in the back of it also um, so we're going to go ahead and get started <clears throat> but I thought that since the colors in here the predominant color was blue that I would take my archival stamp and I would just kind of stamp this um, number one and give it a little bit of color um, so it's not just this bare wood so that's going to be the first thing that we're going to do And it doesn't have to be, for me, it doesn't have to be a solid color on here. I just want something that gives it a little bit of color. <clears throat> so that is it. And then I am going to, I think I am going to put my number one. Hmm. I don't know. I one of the things that I would like to do is um, I am going to cut my writing in half so that it fits perfectly into pockets. And I think I am going to go ahead and do that. I'm just going to get my trimmer and I am going to go to four. that'll work so I think I am going to oh, 
that way it puts it back together and then I am going to put my day one I am going to stick that right here and I need to grab my tape roller I'll be right let me look and see if I've got it in my drawer Let me grab, you know what? I do have my Tim Holtz stapler and I think if it'll work, I think I might use that. And it does. So we're gonna use that, my tiny attachment. So that's gonna be that side. And then my pictures, or my photos are going to go in on the back side. And the reason I wanted to do it um, this way and put the photos for the first one on the back is because one of the covers that I have is this beautiful clear acetate with these stars. And I thought to start out the book, I would like to um, use that one. So I didn't want the photos to interfere. I just thought it would be too much. Um, to cover the photos up like this. I just, I didn't like that look. So I am going to put that down and put this here because my second event is going to be um, the dinner that we also shared um, that week. So I wanted to have the photos together. So the next one's going to have photos and then I'll do my story on the back. So that, guys, is going to be my first December daily. Um, the thing that I wrote um, in here was um, the date, which was 1121, which was the Wednesday before Thanksgiving. And it says, today Liz and I went to UNCW at Keenan Auditorium to see the Nutcracker Ballet. We went last year and had a great time. We decided to go again this year. It did not disappoint. The presentation was a little bit different but it was still beautiful. It it was just absolutely fantastic. Um, and I truly did enjoy myself. And I think I'm gonna try to make it a tradition. So that is going to be it for my December daily day one event. So guys, I hope you will keep um, watching and you get to see all 31 events. So until next time, bye-bye.